More from Victory Base Complex, we're at the Joint Visitors Bureau, Kevin Miller at KIDOAM.com. Captain Upoff is with us here. How are you, sir? I'm doing well this morning, thank you. Um, what was this before uh, y'all took it over? Um, originally it was built uh, to be housing for um, Saddam's daughter's wedding uh, for guests, and then it was turned into a hunting lodge after that. And so we turned it into the hotel. Wow, and if we could take a look up top there, it's uh, quite impressive uh, when you think, and this is really, is this the, the cherry or is this just the beginning of the Sunday? Um, over here, it's really just the uh, beginning of the Sunday, I believe. Um, if you look throughout the, all of Victory Base Complex, um, there are a lot of palaces, a lot of very nice homes that were built. So we've heard about the VIP rooms. We're about ready to go in and actually distinguish visitors' rooms. Captain Offoff, what's, uh, what is this uh, room here? This is the Baghdad room, and this is where we put all of our top distinguished visitors, um, such as uh, Admiral Mike Mullen, uh, the Secretary of the Army, uh, the Secretary of Defense, or uh, the Vice President would stay in a room like this. Um, our normal guests, um, even if the hotel is uh, vacant, don't stay in these rooms. Okay, well, let's take a look as we go in, and uh, we'll follow you. Okay. We're going in. Okay. And what do we, uh, what do we see here, sir? Well, we have the uh, distinguished visitor's bed. It's a king-size bed. Um, and then uh, they do have their own personal equipment uh, to stay physically fit. Most of our DVs really enjoy um, having the treadmill and the bike here. Uh, very fitness conscious and uh, you come over there's room for um, meetings um, they do have uh, the telephone systems in here that they can contact their personnel with um, of course entertainment uh, with a uh, flat screen TV and then they have their own uh, their own uh, latrine uh, bathroom in the civilian world and of course place to store their gear and uh, personal clothes well, we're outside the Joint Visitors Bureau at Victory Base Complex. More with the captain. So uh, we've seen the indoors. What's, what are we looking at now, sir? Well, we're back here on the back patio of the JVB where we hold a lot of barbecues and other uh, distinguished guests' parties. Um, and uh, we come out here, we'll do barbecues for them. Uh, it's a lot of fun for them to get out and relax and kind of get away from the uh, monotonous of the everyday activity. Um, is what she's showing you was uh, Alfal Palace um, uh, right behind us and then as she pans over to the left um, you'll see a tower and there's a mosque over there and then what we call General's Row on the vehicle or uh, buildings to the left of that the largest building over there um, is the uh, the General's house and that used to be Saddam's mom's house No way. in honor of all the folks from home we collected over 2,000 letters and some of those individuals actually gave us personal letters to hand deliver. So this is from the folks back home in Idaho. Oh, and uh, just our way of saying thank you to you and to everybody here. And if you have anything you want to say to the folks, uh, now's your time, sir. Thank you for the support.